My name is Lisa from the RSPCA. Today I'll be showing you how to safely secure your dog in the car when driving using a harness. You could also use a dog crate or a dog guard, but today Taya, our willing participant, will be demonstrating how to use a harness. She travels in the car every day, so she's used to doing this. Make sure your dog is used to travelling in the car and that they're relaxed and don't seem stressed. If your dog displays any signs like barking, whining or drooling a lot, then travelling in the car might be causing them stress. So seek advice from your vet rather than forcing them to travel. While you're in the house or a secure area, take your dog harness, unclip it and ensure all webbing is loose and ready to be worn. Take your dog's paws and gently help them to step into the harness, giving them lots of praise. Simply clip up the harness and tighten it using the webbing on the top. Make sure the harness fits well and is comfortable with no sharp edges that will dig in. Now you're ready to clip on the lead and then carefully and gently take them to your car. So we're just going to get Taya clipped up into her harness. Thread your seatbelt through the harness. So she might need a bit of a hand to come up. There you go, on the seat. Good girl, well done, well done. And let's get you clipped up. Good girl, that was good. So she's nice and relaxed and she sat down on the seat. And then you're good to go. Hey, good girl. Good girl. Wait there. If your dog is used to it, let them jump into the car and sit on the seat. If they're used to being lifted into the car, then do this. This might be better for small dogs or puppies or older dogs with joint problems. And that's it. Using a car harness couldn't be simpler and will ensure your dog is safe and secure when you're driving. I've been Lisa and this is Taya from the RSPCA. Thanks for watching.